Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this repair safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. For better access to replace the heating element in your dishwasher, we recommend fully uninstalling the appliance. Before you attempt this, be sure to turn off the power to the dishwasher and shut off the water supply valve. Using a quarter inch socket or a Phillips head screwdriver, unthread the two mounting screws, securing the lower access panels. Set the panels aside. Use channel lock pliers to unthread the water supply line elbow fitting from the inlet valve. Be prepared for some water to spill. Next, use a quarter inch socket or a T20 Torx bit to unthread the screw to release the junction box cover. Note the orientation of the power wires, then untwist the wire nuts to disconnect the wires. Unthread the screw to release the grounding wire. Unthread the strain relief nut and detach the strain relief and power wires from the junction box. Next, disconnect the drain hose from the sink drain or garbage disposer and feed it through the cabinet. Unthread the mounting screws, securing the dishwasher to the countertop, cabinet, or floor. To move the dishwasher, you may need to adjust the legs to lower the appliance. Now gently pull the dishwasher away from the cabinet. Reach under the dishwasher and disconnect the heating element wires. Use a half inch wrench to unthread the nuts, securing the heating element terminals to the base. Place a weight on top of the dishwasher to stabilize it. Open the dishwasher door and remove the lower dish rack. Pull the lower wash arm assembly straight up to remove. Pull the heating element terminals out of the base and detach the element from the retaining clips to fully remove. Install the new heating element by aligning it on the retaining clips. Then insert the terminals through the holes in the base. Reinstall the wash arm assembly. Replace the lower dish rack. Remove the weight. Now thread and tighten the nuts to secure the terminals. Confirm the sleeves are on the wires, then connect the wires to the terminals. Confirm that the end of the drain hose is accessible through the cabinet wall, then gently slide the dishwasher back into the cabinet. Adjust the leveling legs if necessary. Rethread the screws to secure the appliance to the countertop, 
cabinet or floor. Feed the drain hose through the cabinet and connect it to the sink drain or disposer. Make sure the hose is elevated above the connection point. Fully position the wires and strain relief in the junction box. Then thread and tighten the strain relief nut. Secure the grounding wire with the screw. Join the black wires together and the white wires together and secure them with the wire nuts. With the wires positioned inside the junction box, realign the cover and rethread the screw to secure. Reconnect the water supply line fitting to the inlet valve. Realign the two access panels. Secure them with the two mounting screws. Turn the water supply back on, as well as the power, and your dishwasher should be ready for use.